guys, it's me, Heather, and I'm trying to bring a little holiday spirit to the video. <laughs> um, today's going to be a get ready with me. I haven't done one over here in a very long time. So, to share that I'm back <laughs> and I'm going to be posting a lot more over here, I wanted to do a get ready with me. Some new products, some old products. We're just going to catch up and chit chat if this is your first time here. My name is Heather. I've been a makeup artist for over 22 years. I'm 42. That's kind of the gist of it. I create content on TikTok, Instagram, and of course, YouTube. And we're just going to play in makeup today. So I just start um, my skin prep. I've done, I'm going to do this Wet n Wild Hydra D Puffer. I use it every morning, every time I get ready. If you like the Tula one, it, this is the same. It's cold. So you're getting the same idea. I like to do it up here too because we need all the deep puffing. This is after a long day. I've came home and I'm taking my makeup off and we're doing it again. So <laughs> if I'm red and flustered and all that, that's why. That's why. So um, I've already got moisturizer and all that stuff on. I did that when I took my makeup off. So we're going to just quickly color correct here. Let this sit. I'll do my eyes and then we will come back and do the foundation. But this one is so green that you cannot leave it. You have to like buff immediately. Uh, <laughs> So, but it does a great job getting rid of redness. So if you have a little redness, and this one is $1.98 at Walmart. So LA Colors, and clearly it's cream. <laughs> so when I say I'm back, I just mean I've, I'm uh, making some schedule adjustments, making some more time for being at home, not being so busy. And, um, that means I can create more content and I have time to sit down and do 10 minute chit chat, get ready with me, however long this ends up being. Whereas before TikTok was easier because I can knock out 30 seconds. I can film five videos in 30 minutes, you know, um, and that's with me doing my makeup and all that stuff. So, but expect more videos here. I've already, I got three planned to film today. So, <laughs> you, you know, you're getting at least three new videos for me. So, um, you can see how that just kind of evened out my pink cheeks here. And first of all, this just came in the mail and I said, I have to use it today. Um, I didn't have it this morning. It is the new Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Love Eye Effect, I believe. It's the new one. I got every other year. <laughs> oh yeah. And then, yeah, mm -hmm. yep. <laughs> can you see how beautiful she is? And we're gonna put it on my eyeballs. We're not gonna prime. My eyelids are pretty not red, irritated or anything. So we're just gonna go with it. You at any point cannot do any of this or you can do all of it. But we're gonna take that deep red, that cranberry color and we're gonna go, oh, oh yeah. And don't worry about my complexion being so green. <laughs> that will cover up with my foundation and concealer. All right, so we're doing Halo Eye, if you're not sure, is inside, outside. I think it's something about the fall. I mean, it's 90 in Florida, but <laughs> um, it makes me want to just do a good smoky, this may end up just being a smoky eye, but just a good deep smoky eye, like, and a halo. already with my blue eyes oh, this would be beautiful i mean these tones any color but especially with my blue eyes i love these colors all right don't be alarmed so we're gonna put a little bit of we're gonna take this big big fluffy brush and we're gonna take a little bit of this lighter pink here and we're gonna kind of blend marry that division there on the hood okay see it's all becoming one and then we got a little pink <laughs> mm -hmm. you know I'm not gonna get on here and do this palette a disservice we're gonna have fun with it so <laughs> we can do neutral all day I'm taking this off so why not do something pretty and smoky oh I would I was shimmery pink right in the middle Right here where I kind of left a little bit of an opening. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, worth every penny. Look at that. I mean, we're only seven minutes 
into it because I couldn't stop talking, so. <laughs> oh, yes. Yes. Like this one. Oh, look at the <laughs> catch on the tree. Yeah, right on top of that pretty pink, just right in the smack dab middle of it. <laughs> yep. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, yep. <laughs> All right, so that is this. And we will come back, because you know me, I like to do my first run through with the eyes, finish my face, and then come back. And that's the way we've been doing it for 40 years. So <laughs> we're not going to change it up now. All right. So foundation, I thought, why not just use this? I've already used it a couple times, um, and I thought, let me do it on camera here and this is the elf soft glam and i'll get the shade 11 fair neutral so a lot of people are like yeah how do we know it's awesome we're going to use it <laughs> i did not know i couldn't find it in store anywhere it was always sold out and then i just kind of gave up on it it looks really nice <laughs> my face is very pink remember my body is very pale and let's clean up under these eyes a little bit with the Too faced born this way concealer and remember too, I don't have eyebrows on and I have this dark smoky eye. So it's coming across a lot paler than it is. <laughs> and I have two very, very bright white light, uh, ring lights on me. <laughs> gonna use the e.l.f. It does not have a shade on it anymore. It's their putty bronzer. And you can see that I love it. I just wish it was in a bigger container because I have to force my brush in there to make sure it's good and coated. <laughs> so you guys tell me if you're a creator or if you are, you know, just a viewer, not just a viewer, but you know, you're not creating content, you're viewing the content. Um, what social media outlet do you prefer? Do you like YouTube better? Do you like um tiktok instagram do you like i don't know just tell me which one you prefer um twitter is so much easier to do the others because it's short form <laughs> or it's a photo like instagram is just photos so i can just schedule five photos seven photos a reel whatever like i can sit down and do that in an hour um but i just feel like tiktok's not fun anymore <laughs> it used to be fun I feel like it used to be a lot of fun and it's kind of not fun anymore. I don't know, maybe that's just me, but as a viewer, I find it not fun. I feel like it's a bunch of like, so if you don't know, TikTok started a, um, we're gonna use our powder bronzer now. We're gonna bronze up our neck, yes. Um, TikTok started TikTok shop and they let anybody and everybody start selling products on there, which is great so people can make money. However, there's no, it's as bad as you can imagine. There's no integrity. <laughs> There's no, um, I mean, of course, of course not everybody's that bad, you know, but so you look, we look alive. But I mean, there are people on there selling butt wipes. There's people on there selling adult diapers. They're modeling them. People like somebody's teacher, somebody's Mima is on there showing their lingerie. Like, where do we draw the line? <laughs> Like, when is it too much, right? Like, where, where do we draw the line? And then even worse, you see people on there who are doing all these ridiculous things and they're not even making any sales. I mean, at least I guess if you're showing your ass on there, you're <laughs> making a dollar, but I don't know. Okay, we're gonna try this LYS. I just got these today. This is in the shade Elite. There you go. And I'm not saying I don't share stuff. Like, I'm not selling stuff on there because I am makeup. <laughs> makeup and beauty stuff and stuff that I've tried, I don't accept. I get the craziest request to sell crazy stuff. And I say, no, thank you, because that's not my channel. And people I started watching because they were makeup artists sold out for protein chips. And, you know, like, <laughs> I don't care about how much protein you get in your protein chips. I wanted to see you apply that brand new palette that you got, but... Maybe that's me. And maybe I'm showing my old age. I'm getting disgruntled. But I'm like, I can always come back to YouTube. And we, 
I just want the community of people who love makeup. I don't need, you know, to buy anything or sell anything. <laughs> if you want to buy from me for my links, I appreciate it. I love it, but that's where we're drawing the line. We're not selling out for anything. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to take that darkest color that I did my halo eye with, and we're going to go under the lash line. Perfect, like taped off eye. I like smudge. I like it to look worn. <laughs> that's the uh, skateboarder in me. I used to light my, mess, my black liner with a lighter and stick it in there so it was all melty and then just take it and just rub it on there as eyeshadow. <laughs> all right, Too Faced had sent me over some of their ooh, killer liners and this is in Killer Queen, but look at that color. I feel like it's perfect for this eye look. So we're gonna use it. Uh-oh, do these need to be sharpened? Oh God, I hate a sharpen. <laughs> Not like I don't have 18 sharpeners. We're gonna take a little bit of this Tarte highlighter. It's a little golden, but we need a little, a little shine here. You know I can't be without my shine. <laughs> and then we'll take a little bit. These brushes are clean, I swear. I just used them this morning. I've been going live on TikTok um, for a brand called Ola Cosmetics. I go live and do makeup for them um, every Thursday, 6 to 8 p.m. <laughs> if you're on TikTok and you want to come hang out. But that's been very fun and very rewarding get to be a makeup artist with them and go live and show their products and do tutorials. Um, and that's my favorite thing, you know, I love to teach people makeup and ignite that passion for makeup for people. So that's been very rewarding. And that's why I don't want to leave TikTok entirely. <laughs> uh, not that I would, but I'm just saying like, you know, my block game, my mute game is strong. <laughs> so I can, you know, do my thing, enjoy my my time and not let anybody steal that joy from me. So, um, oh, and then we got this. That Too Faced sent this over as well. You have to like waterproof mascara. If not, you need the pink one. But if you like waterproof, this is the best. Look at those lashes. Can you see? Probably not, but. A birthday kiss, kissing jelly. Set Sephora, I believe. Sparkly, it looks purple, but it's mostly pink. So this is my, this is my look with my new, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, my new Charlotte palette. So if you've been eyeballing it and these colors speak to you and I say, obviously it's a go. No questions asked. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. If you're not already subscribed, please be sure you are. And um, yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye.